Hi, this is Bobby Fazy, attorney with Inside Law, and this topic is what is a trust and how can it benefit me? So there's a couple benefits of a trust and, and there's a couple levels of benefits. The first is uh, one is avoiding probate. So what is probate is when you pass away, if you own assets in your individual name, uh, what happens is that the state will want to know what all your assets are and your liabilities are and you're going to file court paperwork and not you but your family members are and anytime i found that i'm going to court uh, it's usually a waste of time expensive and uh, public uh, action so uh, what we do with the trust is when you pass away uh, there's nothing actually in your own name at death to actually go through the court process so think of a trust as nothing more than a box and you put all of your instructions on the box and you put your assets in it and when you pass away William Sample didn't own anything at death in his own name so there's no reason to go to court pass the box over to my uh, spouse or my niece to manage those assets and distribute them keep it within the family protected uh, no thank you government we don't want you to be involved so that's one level of benefit of the trust second level of benefit is disability planning so with disability on the disability planning side is you can put very customized instructions on uh, with regard to the trust and think of the instructions just being on the outside i want if i become disabled i want to be taken care of at home i want this level of care and we have checklists that could be very customized to kind of what kind of planning that you want on that but we don't have to rely on a power of attorney which isn't so powerful and a much more powerful trust that says this person, the trustee, manages these assets within this, within this trust. No thank you financial institution or court or guardianship. We're not going to deal with that and we're keeping everything in-house and private. Third level of benefit is uh, asset protection for your loved ones after you've passed away. And that's really only with the trust you can do it. So think of a trust as an open box during your lifetime. You can get into the assets, but also the credit, your creditors can during your lifetime with a revocable trust. When you pass away under trust law, you can, if it's, if it's drafted properly, you can say, I'm closing the lid on this box and I'm leaving these assets to my loved ones for their health, their education, and their maintenance, but not for their creditors, not for their ex-spouses. This is my money to be used this way. Now, their money is fair game on with regard to whatever creditors and predators out there that are waiting for them. But for your money, the way you can structure that with a, the, with a trust is to protect your hard-earned wealth. So those are just some very nice, uh, easy points to understand the benefits of the trust. One, no government or court involvement if it's uh, funded properly. Number two, uh, comprehensive disability planning, and number three, asset protection for your loved ones after you pass away. This has been Bobby Fazy, attorney with Insight Law. Thank you very much.